Don't talk like that, Mommy. time whenever I can get it especially with my girl Jill on the go on the phone whenever we can catch up it's a good thing gone on the days of just hanging out and catching up whenever we want in comes real life in comes responsibility and now you just gotta do what you gotta do I mean responsibility is not a bad thing I'm responsible for two beautiful girls it's just before I had them I couldn't see my life with them and now that I have them I can't see my life without them and I can't see this hairdo working today, so I'll just wear a wig. Hey girl, my flight lands at 1.30, so I scheduled a cab for two. I'll pick you up from the airport, cancel the cab. Oh no, you don't have to, I always catch a cab. Cancel that cab. I'll be there at 1.45. Okay, Karen. All right, girl. I'll see Corporate America, you are always on the go. I know. Wait, wait, uh, I know you're doing your dream job, so that comes with the territory. Yeah, well. Uh, what? What's the problem? The job is great, and that is the problem. The job is great, but that is the problem. Mm -hmm. I don't understand. What's, what are you talking about? I have company. You have company. They moved somebody into your cubicle with you? They demoting you? Well, what? Oh, you bought a company? No. Come on with the guessing. This is not a million dollar pyramid. Get it together. I have company. You have. Ah! You have company! Oh my god, I knew it. This is so exciting. What do you mean? Yeah, thanks. Jill, stop. What is that? Mm, thanks. What is that about? I mean, I am excited. I am really excited. And I love Jameson. And we've been together for a while, but. No, it's just timing is just off because we're both just taking off in our careers and this could really really make us miss out on some opportunities we need to be taking advantage of are you kidding me first of all Jameson mr. Conceding himself is gonna be super stoked you know he's gonna love having a little mini me running around or a mini you as much as he's into you by the way I've been meaning to talk to you it's just a little bit inappropriate how much IIP you guys have going on uh, I mean all that down the throat while I'm standing there uh, having a gag it's just totally okay okay yeah you're right Karen you're right you're right I'm excited now. So tell me, how are you going to tell him? I'm just going to tell him. Call him over. No, no, this is huge. This is big. You got to make it special. You don't just tell him. You got to make it like a grand old affair. Come on. You should let me do it. Oh, I have the perfect plan. Let me do it. Just leave me your key. Go to work. And when you come home at 730, I'll have it all planned out. Okay. Ah, we're going to be moms together. It's so exciting. Might not have much now. Hi Jill, I'm so glad that one of my girlfriends is finally going to get to experience the joy of motherhood with me. You're going to love it. Or maybe not, but either way, misery loves company. Now someone else will see what it feels like to have their little hot dress snatched from under them and replaced with a girdle. <laughs> no, for real. Kids are going to make your heart skip a beat when their little finger wraps around your finger. On the tough times, on the roughest day, their smile makes everything better. You guys are going to love it. Welcome to this new journey, and I'm going to capture the whole thing for you. <laughs> hey, girl. Hey. Look at these. Oh, cute. Oh, oh I'm Karen, I'm nervous. What? Why? What are you talking about? That's your man, remember? Okay, well, maybe I'm not nervous. I'm just anxious. Excited. I'm just ready to get it out. I want to hear what he's going to say. You know, I want to start this new adventure in our lives. <laughs> Look what I got on the way home from the gym. <gasps> oh, it's so cute. I can't wait for my little JJ to come with his TT. Oh, God. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, it's in the file. Okay. Yeah. Hey, babe. What's up, babe? You know, just glad to be home from Virginia. And you know I'm glad to have my sweetie stuff back. <laughs> come here. Mwah. Come here, come here. Mwah. <laughs> 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 oh, something Ooh. No, when I'm stuck.
starving. What you cooking, girl? Oh, I'm cooking something. Good, because your man is ready to eat it up. <laughs> <laughs> cooking something, but it's not food. Huh? I'm cooking something, but it's not food. <laughs> what? Let's cook some food. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pregnant! <laughs> Girl, stop playing. I'm not playing. I am pregnant. So we're pregnant. We're pregnant. So you're having my baby. And it means so much to me. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Hold on, hold on. You're serious. We didn't even talk about this. And we already put together a five year plan and it doesn't include this. I mean, what are you doing, boo? <laughs> well, technically I didn't do this by myself. Well, the timing is bad for the both of us. Well, you know, we... timing, timing, it changes. You know, what can look like a bad situation, once you really get in there and the, 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 the family starts to form, there's a whole new... Um, okay, okay, excuse me, can I have a private moment? Damn! Who? Who? Who are you talking to? Are you, are you talking to me? Yeah, I'm talking to you. You're, you're not. You, Hold up. Yeah. Hold up, now, see, because Karen, see what Karen. I'm trying to. Karen, maybe you should probably just go. What? What? Are you serious? Because he doesn't seem too stable right now. Asking me for privacy in Karen, a situation where. to the end though, huh? Even through the most uncomfortable moments. How do we even get in these uncomfortable moments? You know, it's like you're sitting under a bright blue sky and sunny and it's a beautiful day and then all of a sudden, it starts to rain. Not rain, it starts to pour. And the weatherman didn't even tell you there was gonna be a cloud in the sky. But you know, if you can't predict the rain all the time, then you can't predict the sunshine either. Jill. Hey girl. Oh, I am so sorry about everything that happened, girl. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. You know, I was overreacting and, and I was talking way too much. And I, I know he just probably wanted to really just take it in and you know have it in the privacy of his own. Crazy situation. Not what I was expecting at all. Yeah. But I get it. I get it. I just I just didn't think he would be so against it. Jill, he's not a bad guy. He just he was just surprised. You know? Well, it wasn't in my plans either, but here I am. No, here we are. I'm here too for you, girl. And look, Jameson's going to come around. You know he is. That's your man. He's going to be your husband. Everything's going to be fine. Just just give him a second. Let it sink in. Mm, I don't know. He made it pretty clear that this is not what he wants. Why? What did he say? He said he wants a marriage and not a family. What? It doesn't matter what he has to say because uh, my decision's made and my appointment's on Friday. What are you talking about? Not keeping this baby. All I have.